Hello, I'm Henning. I work as a teacher at the Organic Farmer Education at the Organic Agricultural College in Denmark. For the next three minutes, I'll take you to the new European Education Programme. The education programme will be planned according to a personal educational plan that takes from two to four years. The education as such is altering between practical training with salary and theoretical learning at the college. All the program is taught in English. You will pay no tutoring fee at the college. The place is the Organic Agricultural College of Denmark, situated nearby Aarhus. At the end of the program, you will have an education as farm assistant or skilled organic farmer. You will have salary during your practical training and, to some extent, during the schooling period as well. Why? Why do we participate in European education? First of all, Danish farmers need trainees from outside Denmark. We like to push the organic movement forward. We like to cre create better networks in Europe, between farmers and across borders. We like to improve knowledge transfer within Europe and develop open European vocational education program. We have 25 years of experience in organic agriculture teaching. We like also to develop the college and the staff within it. The education. You can choose farm assistant or the longer four-year program skilled farmer. Both will start with half a year's schooling period, followed by a period of 12 months practical training, followed again by half a year's um, courses at school, and finishing with some practical training. The theoretical training. At Classroom we normally have 25 students. We do lectures, we do group work, and you will be asked to do self-study as well. At the school we have school farms, stables, fields and machinery. We do excursions to farm and companies, diary plants, slaughterhouses, etc. The subjects at the school. You can find a full program at farmeducation.dk. The main subjects are animal husbandry, plant production, machinery, techniques, economy, and politics. The practical training will take place at a Danish farm. The farmer normally speaks English. You will be employed as an assistant. You will have monthly salary. And as all workers in Denmark, you will have a five week holiday without salary. Economy. You'll pay no tuition fee at, for the education, but you'll have to pay for food and for lodging. And you can also buy books, participate in excursions, have some copies. A total amount of 3,200 kroner you need to pay each month. The expenses, if you look at them at a total for OF1, will consist of a deposit, five months of 3,200 kroners, four months of the same amount, all in total for the OF1 farm assistant education, 32,800 kroners. The OF2 program consists of the same um, fractions with the same monthly salary, a total of 36,000 Danish kroner. The income, if you look at your salary and your, your payment at school, will be for OF1 261,000 and for OF2 351,000. Qualifications to enter the school. It's very important that you can speak and understand English. It's important that you are motivated for intercultural learning in Denmark and in Europe as such. It's important that you are interested in organic farming. As an international student, you might benefit from have some previous learning within agriculture, maybe a degree from your own country of origin. It's good to have some practical training in agriculture. You will benefit furthermore from having a driver's license. 
the study guide for EU citizens are as follows. You need to apply for to be a student at the organic farm and you need to receive a letter of your accept that you're accepted as a student. You need to arrive to Denmark before college starts. There you need to visit a farmer, maybe do some introduction. You need to sign a contract and an education agreement. With the education agreements and the paper from the school, you can go to the state administration where you can have a registration card uh, as a student for staying in Denmark. When? The college calendar for 2009 to 2011 starts 3rd of August 2009, where the first schooling periods of half a year takes place. From January 2010 until the end of this year, you have practical training. From January 2011 uh, and six months ahead, you will attend school again. And from 4th of January 2011 um, and ahead, you can also attend the second schooling period. You can find more information at organicfarmer.dk. The Organic Agricultural School have two student advisors. One, Knut, is the advisor focusing on Denmark. The other, Thomas, is the student advisor for the international students. He speaks Danish, English, Polish and understands very well Russian. The school is situated central in Denmark, <coughs> nearby Aarhus, with very good connections to Copenhagen. We are situated nearby the sea, with a beautiful sea view to the center of Aarhus. We live in the heart of the nature, with the forest nearby and the fields on the other side, and with a beautiful view to the sea. At the college campus you'll find all facilities needed for learning. We have the facilities for practical training, 50 hectares of plant production and vegetables, and we have animals as well. Campus life here in Kalu is special as to, we live together with a folk high school with almost the same number of students at, as at the agricultural school. In summertime we have good outdoor facilities. At the auditorium um, 125 students can attend lessons. At the second main course <coughs> we do study tours field study tours around Europe and in Denmark. Last year we spent a week in Spain and Italy. This year we go to Italy and to Sweden. Thank you for attending the program of the Organic Pharma Education.